up everybody and welcome to my channel i'm edward the fr666 and today we are playing episode number three from the hogwarts legacy let's continue our journey okay as i told you last time we were here um we have some missions to do uh let's see m for minimap oh here are a lot of things um what are those we are here so let's go for this thing here ah i can't imagine how muggles get by without magic almost makes me feel a bit guilty okay let's go here inside acquiring mind rebellion okay something how do we get there? Uh, okay, don't mind me. I mean, I'm just gonna come here. There will be a jump scare. No? Okay, I guess we just stole the money and <laughs> um yes. Hmm. Let's speak with this gentleman here. Yes. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts, Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda's student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then. I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, uh, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest, creating something out of nothing. Of course, it is not without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, and you could soon impress even Professor Weasley. He's speaking really strange. To aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I too see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. For now, let's get the spellcrafts you need. A potting table and a potion station. Yes? I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew what you want when you want. Let's have a look. Okay, we have black like, shop. Have, shall we? Pointing table with a small pot unlocks the ability to conjure a pointing table with a small pot. Unlocks the ability to conjure small potions station. Perfectly sweet. Ah. Uh. I think we're going for the first one. Ah, we, we need both of them. If you're interested, feel free to take a look around at the rest of my infantry. Now we can buy things here. We're not gonna use it. Doing business with you. We're not going to use this tool. 500 we need 500 hero what beast toy box spell i like the ability to conjure a beast toy use a toy box to pick up your beast's favorite toys okay interesting so we have a shop interesting let me know if there's anything else i can do to help nope okay welcome to da 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 in person we found another thing interesting what's up mister you're looking like someone that head a mission keep streaming <laughs> thank you thank you <laughs> um what should 
push as the mission right now. I have no clue. Uh, repair your what is this? Okay. I have no clue where shall I go. I think we're just moving forward. Okay. It's black. Hmm. Where is the mission? I don't understand. Ah, here, look. Oh my god, I'm so blind. Ah, they are in the houses. Okay. Hello. Something to close, uh, to steal. I wasn't stealing her. Third, I wasn't stealing. Oh my god. I'll be right with. Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. Where do you know me from? Uh, hello, sir. I'm looking for, for a new wand. Yes, it's about time. Yes, uh, about time. We are getting our wand. You're a student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest one makers in the world. It's a yeah. pleasure to meet you. Truly. Now, come with me. Why are the people so strange here? One, shall we? Mm, uh, no, 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 not you. Um, ah, yes. Yes. Hmm. Green. <laughs> ten and a half inches. Hmm. Uh, ten and a half inches. It's a little bit big. He yeah. tells me. Give this one a try. Well, go ahead. Swish. Hmm. How odd. Uh, once more. Come on. Really swish it. Oh my God. <laughs> Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, I mean, 10 inches are a little bit too much for me. <laughs> no, not you. Uh, uh, hmm, perhaps. Yes. 13 inch. 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon heart string. Oh, no. Let's give this one a try. Oh. 13 inches. Oh my god, it's getting bigger and bigger. Oh my god, we're going for 50 inches. Looks like it's back to the shelf for you. <sighs> this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? I think I, li I like it big. Big one. There you are. Yes, I think you might be the one. Here, take it. Uh, show it to me. What is this? Wood type willow, four type phoenix feather, flexibility whippy, eleven and three quarters inches. Curious indeed. What is this? Finalize one time. Ah, we can intriguing natural gray, you know. Red brown. Oh my god, the form is really strange. Okay. Honey brown. Curious indeed. Spiral. Soft spiral. Classic gray. Hmm. How intriguing. I mean, I, I, I don't like 
any of them. I mean, that's... Curious indeed. Hmm. How intriguing. Uh, I have no clue. I, I, I guess... We are going for this one. Wood type. Willow. Curious indeed. Followed vine. Oh my god. That's a little bit way too much info for me. Length 14 inches. I'm yelling 14 inches. Curious indeed. 10 inches, 9 inches. Uh, I'm gonna take it. The longest. Dogwood. Oh my god. How intriguing. Uh, I see an alder, apple, ash, aspen, bench. Why? Well, I have no clue what kind of trees are these. I swear on god. I have no. Indeed. Ebony. What is this? Elder. Bro, I don't even know how are they looking like. Because there is no difference. Okay, we're going for English Elder. I don't know. Flexibility. Quite bendly. It... Uh, can you test um, maybe Lark? How intriguing. The effect quite flexible and surprising. Swifty, Swifty. It's a weepy, fine, bright, hard, solid, stiff, rigid, unbending, slightly yelling, unyelling. I think the last one. What the? They're gonna hurt. Her steering that serve as a core of a one nose for producing powerful magic. Unicorn. The hair of unicorn that serves as a core of one nose for producing consistent magic. Phoenix feather. The feather of the phoenix that serve as core of the wand capable of producing a great range of magic. Uh, I think Dragon. Heartstring wand is most powerful and learns quickly. I... How intriguing. He's not speaking anything anymore. I was thinking that he will say something. Hmm. A unicorn hair wand is most reliable and faithful to its owner. Honor, okay. Curious indeed. Okay, tell me this one what it's doing. Yes, now it's working perfect. What what is this? Phoenix feather. Exceptionally rare and a core with a strong sense of initiative. Okay, we're going for a dragon. I think that's what we get, boys? Fourteen and a half inches. <laughs> uh, yes, I made it to whisper. What do you think? Another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical future. Oh my god. <sighs> the 14 inches. Um. Now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. I would imagine so. 
A wand with a dragon heartstring core is capable of dazzling magic. And the bond between you and your wand should only grow stronger. Do not be surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again, if ever I can be of further assistance. Hmm. I don't know if we, we choose it correctly. Uh, why? I, because I didn't know exactly what Lark is doing. Uh, but I'm gonna set it for the chat. You are right. Okay, let's visit the potion thing. We got the wand. Um... Potion, we are going to, to see a potion. But first of all, I want to go here inside. Rebellion. Ah, look. Um, I think it's... Okay, never mind. What is here? What's that? Uh, 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 oh, I guess I'm stealing and drinking some something. Oh, <laughs> they're not getting less than this. I will be a fucking alcoholic. What's up, misters? Okay, nothing interesting here. Or maybe... I want some missions, some action. Ah, let's go for the mission. There's nothing interesting. Are you stealing, mister? What? Every time when we are seeing a cat, we are gonna pet it. That's the rule, guys. That's the rule. What is this? Okay, we are selling. Well, Yo, what's up, bro? Nice chest you've got here. Oh, we got items like armor and shit. What? No, I've, I've got something, right? Offense, what is offense? I don't know what is this, but okay. Okay, interesting. What's up, bro? Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I don't believe I've seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? Well, Parry Pippin at your service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. <laughs> You'll have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. Hmm. I set your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. 
Is it not the most fascinating art potion making? Rivals anything you can do with a wand, I've always said. A potion's really that versatile. They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect. You'll discover all of this soon enough. As it's your first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses, and I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can, so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? Okay. Uh, for now. Interesting. Let's get you those recipes, shall we? Yes, please give me the reception. What can I do for you today? A wise decision. Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory, or come back another time if you're in a rush today. I am actually in a rush today. I hope to see you again. Revelio. Well for now. Want to steal it? I need 500 gold. We can swim. Where is this thing? And how can I go there? That's my question. Let me go. What's up, bro? How can I open this? Lumos. Hmm, I have to learn how to use it. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was. Um, what's our quest now? Visit the magic herbs. Okay, they are here. Let's see. I saw this. You did not pay attention in the classes. Ah! Oh, <laughs> Never. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged. What is British English? Oh, Pardon. Me for the new fifth year. <laughs> I take it that's you then. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth year. You must be positively reeling from it all. Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo! Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's Timothy Teasdale, by the way, and this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things if I'm hidden away inside now, can I? I suppose not. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. My speciality is potion ingredients. Even Pippin purchases from me. But what say we get you a packet of Dipney seeds? Yes, sir. Okay, give me. Let me guess. You're after something fresh. All right. Um. Uh, thank you a lot. Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your. Good luck to your stream. I'm come. Uh, I'm gonna join later. Better go and find Natty. No one can say I don't keep a stack shelf. Okay, let's see Netty. Let's meet with Netty. Revelio. Netty, where are you? Ah, oh, here are you. Not doing anything interesting. Ah, I have everything. <laughs> we should walk around a bit more. Perhaps today is the day I finally pick one. Oh, 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 that's the first fight. What is this? 
Oh my god, that's a boss fight. Oh no. Oh my god, what's going on? What is going on? Control dodge. No HP. Oh, my God. No, no, he Okay, the red attacks. Oh my god. Okay, the red attacks I can block. Our cadabra. Goodness, a second troll. Did you two take on a fully grown troll? By yourselves? I suppose so. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? We are, and we were glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that? The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, Officer. Singer. Officer Singer. Okay. And thank you, again. Oh my god. Oh. Repair. Put all back in the place. How it's supposed to look. Okay, we got our first boss fight. One less thing for us to sing it to worry about. One needs to be repaired. Repair. I don't know what what should be repaired.
one more thing to be repaired, but what? Off on another adventure. Oh, hello, money. Repair it. I see nothing destroyed anymore. Oh my god, I, I really can see. Repairer. Be here inside the house. What's up, kids? I have to pet them. Every single kid in this game. <laughs> oh, I really like it in this game. But I really can get it what is what not right. We have to repair something here, but I don't get what. I think we are gonna spy my. Interesting, but I still can see what should be repaired. Okay, do you know where what should be repaired? Oh. I don't know what should we repair, I swear on God.
Prepare Hmm. I guess that's really interesting. No, I can repair it. this I see nothing that is broken You know what? I'm gonna save it and reconnect. Maybe it's a bug or something like this. That's really interesting. Maybe maybe it was a bug or something like this. I can't explain. Oh, hello there. A, a moment, if you would. I will see what he wants. Rebellion. Repairer. One. Two. Let's pet the kiss. Okay, this one should be repaired too. One less thing for Officer Singer to worry about. And that's the last one. Oops. Sorry, bro. <laughs> okay. Interesting, so let's repair it again. 
I didn't know that <laughs> there, so is to break. Rebellion. Let's visit the cats again. Hey cats. Okay, now let's go to the mission. Just talking about you. That's not good. You have too much free time. Okay, let's speak with him. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've Hello, met. Hello, sir. Uh, to introduce myself, uh, Augustus Hill, Clothia Extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin. But I can offer you something much more useful. Oh, yes, I'm glad Rags wizard wear and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. And as I suspect this won't be your last dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Okay. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. Uh, now, uh, let's try this on for size, shall we? Yes. Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. How? Recurrent in defense and offense are displayed on the top rack. Okay. Select the clock and robes. And plus five, plus six. I don't know if I. I expect you have a sharp eye for fashion. What an extraordinary introduction to Hogsmeade. I would say that we, and you in particular, have earned at least one butterbeer. Shall we head to the three broomsticks? Sounds like a good idea. Wonderful. Just down this way then. Okay, let's drink something. I sell even more battle work. Wait a second. What was the other one? They are looking identically I don't know I'm gonna hold it should you be inclined you're most welcome to peruse my shop at your leisure okay Oh, I'll need to the three bombs. Assuming it is not too busy, you might even meet Serona, the owner. She is a charming hostess and a powerful witch. Good one to know. Hmm, okay. You said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student take down your distraction. <laughs> Child, what are you not telling me? All you need to know is that if you cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. <sighs> Let's go. Hmm. Did they see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Ranrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, 
Let's get inside the three broomsticks. Hmm. Shit. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gok. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. Oh my god, what was this voice? Okay, I'll let's drink some of them. Oh, there's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one, single handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thanks for this. My pleasure. I will say, trolls in Hogsmeade, that's never happened before. That's unusual. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... Uh, oh no, he found us. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? Your clientele's not what it used to be, Sarona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, <laughs> Calibre... Everybody can see me, I'm so green. <laughs> I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come. It's not like I'm not a vision. Theatrics? I'm only here for this one anyway. Oh, he recognized me. My friend me. is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. I said, my friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, Theophilus. The Three Broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butterbeer forever. Oh my god. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls, Ranrock, and Rookwood. What are you not telling me? I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. I think that now might be a good time to head back to the castle. Yes. Let's go back to the castle. I think they will attack us. Lumos. I am certainly glad Serona was there. And that she isn't intimidated by thugs like Brookwood and Harlow. I want to understand mm. what's going on, and I hope you will tell me. But for the moment, we should return to the castle. Professor Weasley will certainly hear about the troll attack soon if she hasn't already. I don't want her to worry. Okay, how good the map? And where? Okay, let's fast travel there. My god, this game is getting better and better and better okay so we're back what is our mission now <clears throat> fast travel until there we're gonna fast travel shoot oh Professor Fig, come and see me. I've discovered something in the locket we found at Ringo. 
Okay. First things first. I have to speak with that girl. Okay, she's not that far away. Let's talk with her. Nora, I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? I found the location depicted in the painting, and then I cast Lumos to guide him off back to the frame. All very logical, I suppose. Pity I was so close to solving it. You have a knack for solving riddles. Natty's good at that too. So is Meat, although he does tend to overexplain. Well, I'm glad someone figured it out. Yay. I should have seen that. Okay, I guess we're going for the main mission now. We we will be able to to find some Jails. I don't feel well. Why don't you go and see Nurse Blaney? Yes. Oh. Hello there. Perhaps you can help me. What the? Oh. Can you help me? Hello. Were you calling me? I was. Yes. I thought you might be interested. It in was the guy that was tripping. Adventure. <laughs> following a treasure map, to be precise. Slight respite from battling the odd troll, I should think. Asked Poppy if she'd be interested as well, but couldn't drag her away from her puff skein. I found two maps lying about, both leading to locations around Hogwarts. Care to have a look at one? Following a Hogwarts treasure map. Count me in. Wonderful. Hogwarts fascinates me. You can keep whatever treasure lies at the end of your map. I'll be satisfied just knowing where it leads. Very well. I shall take a look if I can find the time. Fair enough. Meet me back here if you find anything. All right. Now we're going for the main mission, first of all. Where are you, Mr. Professor? I'm here. Oh. Rebellion. Uh, Professor. Professor, I'm glad to see you. And I, you. Thank Merlin, you're in one piece. I heard about the attack. Trolls in Hogsmeade? Sir, the trolls were wearing armor. It had that dark glow, like the dragon collar. Goblin silver! Ranrock used it to control the dragon. But how? And why send trolls to... They were there because of me. I overheard Ranrock talking with Victor Rookwood. Ranrock was in Hogsmeade with Rookwood. The trolls were Ranrock's distraction so that Rookwood could get to me. And he would have, had Serona and the patrons at the Three Brumsticks not intervened. This is great news indeed. If Ranrock's goblins and dark mm -hmm. are after you, they want what we found in that vault. Speaking of the vault, do you think that Ranrock is working with any of the goblins at Gringotts? I do not. 
Gringotts goblins aren't typically the friendliest of beings, but they have a great deal of integrity. No, I dare say after what happened to that poor bank, mm -hmm. the goblins at Gringotts are no followers of Ranrock. They're after the locket. You said you discovered something in it. Yes, yes. I discovered an inscription. When I read it aloud, this map appeared. Clever enchantment. It's a map of Hogwarts, to be sure, but I do not know where it leads. It leads to the library. A restricted section, to be precise, and a bit beyond. I see traces of magic there on the map. I suspected you would see something. Should we go? I appreciate your enthusiasm, and I'm eager to discover what we may find there as well. But if our experience at Gringotts, let alone what happened to Miriam, taught me anything, it's that the path we're on is terribly dangerous. I'd like you to work with Professor Heckett a bit before we continue. But sir, how dangerous could the library be? Perhaps we're only after a book. Perhaps we are only after a book, but we should be prepared for anything. Once you've honed your defensive magic further, come and see me. Okay. I'll let Professor Heckett know to expect you. Revelio. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> Why are you just trying? Okay, I guess we're going to learn some defenses. Rebellion. Interesting. Okay. Let's move on. Let's learn some defenses. Ah, oh, down. now I'm busy I have to learn defenses I'm here about the new spell you wanted to teach me professor good uh, professor fig indicated a certain urgency to you completing your defensive magic assignments as such you are to learn incendio incendio oh my god for lighting torches burning away spider webs and when necessary defending against those who would wish to do us harm sounds uh, versatile quite but before we get started i'd like you to complete a few tasks you may be surprised by some of them astonishing how much students don't think their professors know when you're finished come and see me then we shall begin working on incendio you know where to find me once you've finished Okay. Guys, I think that's everything for today. Um, we had a boss fight. We got the bug. And uh, it was quite interesting. So let's hope that the next episode would be more interesting than this one. Until next time, I'm Edward the first 666. Thank you a lot for watching me. And see you. Ciao. <laughs>